Hey everyone, I wanted to show you today a little bit about how to use your last day of hair before needing to wash it. So this is day four for me and it's coming to an end very quickly because it's getting pretty gross. So I want to show you a quick updo on how to utilize this, like I said, before you have to wash it. So I'm going to use again a little bit of the print to powder. So it's going to absorb some of the oils that I have from the last four days. Even though I did use it yesterday, it still is good to use a little bit more just to give it some grip and absorb some of the oils, especially around your hairline. So I'm going to mess it up. And then you're going to take a tail comb and tease it and start in the front when you tease. Or you can start in the back, it doesn't really matter, whatever's easiest for you. And then take about three different sections. And when you tease, it's important that you start at middle of the strand and go down, down, down. You don't have to go all the way to the top of the hair strand and like rat it that way because then it just becomes just a like ready mess. So just three different strokes down. Um, and then kind of, you know, pull it back. If the sides need a little bit of body, you can do those kind of around the whole crown middle section. And if it looks a little crazy, that's okay because you're going to be putting it back down and smoothing it back out. But the bigger the better because you're going to be smoothing it out. So this just kind of flopped. Let's say you have that. It just flops like that. I'm just going to go back and take another smaller section and really make sure that front part is teased really well. So you have your hair like that, so you're going to take your band, and I have just a bumble band. Um, they're called, and they were made um, a few years ago uh, for runway shows. They had taken them off bra straps, and this is how the bumble band was started. So I'm going to use this one. Um, you can buy some really cute decorative ones. This one's from Francesca's. Um, otherwise, I'm sure Claire's icing, whatever they, I'm sure, have stuff like that, too. So I just want to use a simple black one for myself. So you get done teasing, and then you're going to put it around your neck. And I'm going to use a little bit of hairspray to just kind of get those little flyaways back. I'm using the spray to mode, which is, adds a little bit of shine and hold. So you put the band in. And you can wear some bands across your forehead, kind of like the hippie style. Um, I'm just going to wear it right behind my hairline. And then you're going to take just a simple hair tie. I use skinny ones because I have fine hair that sometimes people use the big fat ones when they have thin hair. And I don't really suggest that because their hair is so fine that it can actually break the hair off if you use the big chunky um, black hair band. So I'm just going to use a skinny um, black one. I'll try to turn around so you can see. So it kind of looks like a, you know, it's got some body to it. And um, I don't mind having that texture to it. I don't want it to be really smooth, smooth. So just take it into a ponytail like that. And then you can make this just a ponytail and then wrap around a piece, which would be really cute. I am going to make a messy bun because I want to show you how I make my messy buns. And, you know, you can kind of take it from there. So I loop it around once. And then before I come around the second time, I kind of grab some of the hair and then I take my left hand and kind of use that to mess it up. Oh, see, now I'm malfunction and I have a broken hair tie. Let me grab another one. So this is what can happen. Like, it can get frustrating because your arms get tired from holding it up. Holding your hands up, but grab another one. So I take it around once. The second time, I'm going to take that my left hand and mess it up. And loop it around. And it's going to be tight and hard to do. And then, so it's in like that. And then you're just going to take your hands, both hands, and just keep pulling it apart. 
mirror and you can kind of see where you're going. So you see I have this kind of like long piece and you know, this is kind of just hanging there, but I want to make it messy and fun. So I'm going to take some hairspray and just spray it so it gives a little bit of grip. And if you look at the front, now it's not poofy or have any body again to it. So take your tail comb and you can pull it out or you can use your hands and try to pull it back out so that you get some more body out of it. 